floor of the CME Group. This is Danny Riley with today's Mr. Top Step Update. You know, the, the, when, the, when the credit crisis hit the U.S. and we came about some of our, our things that we wanted to do to resolve the crisis, it was said that it would spread into Europe. And now that that is spread into Europe, there's talk that it could spread into Asia. This contagion seems to be going global now. But that said, the S&P that closed on a firm note yesterday at the 1252.40 level got all the way down to 1234 last night. It was down 18 handles. But this morning, it opened, it opened up at the 1245 level, traded down to 1244, and just popped up to 1253, actually higher on the day. Now, what we really believe is going on here is that you got a couple of things. One, it's mid-month. And at mid-month, you get a little bit of rebalancing going on by some of the professional portfolio managers and hedge funds buying stock. And two, the market's made several higher lows recently and seems to be trying to hold despite all the negatives that are floating around. Now, this morning, part of the up move was a better retail sales number. And what the markets did is they rallied back above unchanged. Now, this is a game that a lot of the prop traders in New York do. It's called the unchanged game. The markets are lower, they get back up toward the unchanged or a little higher, they start feeding out a little bit on the sell side, and that's the way they play that game. It works a lot of times, and if you watch it, you'll see that you know the markets will short cover up toward unchanged and then flop back down. That's basically what we're doing right now. The S&P is back down about four handles. You know, we're gonna leave it at that. The volumes have been really light here over the last couple of days, averaging in between about 1.6 and 1.8 million a day. That's way lower than what we've been used to seeing over the last couple of months. We'll be back with another Mr. Top Stop update, and thank you very much.